Hi, this is Natalia and I'm recording for you my vlog. Today let's talk about uh, students' life and studying pros process at the University of Mons. I'm gonna share with you my top 5 tips on both of these uh, uh, subjects uh, and let's start with the students' life. My tip number 1. I'm suggesting you or I'm even begging you to find an accommodation if you're living far than 30 kilometers from the university. Why? Because it will, sell, it will save your time, it will save your nerves and um, you will have uh, a possibility to participate uh, of the cultural life uh, of this beautiful city of Mons. My tip number two. Uh, think uh, beforehand uh, about your meal, about the food. Yes, it's better to have uh, homemade food uh, with you uh, for all days of the week. Why? Because uh, you will not spend your pocket money, uh, you will not buy snacks or sweets or another unhealthy food or drinks <laughs> and um, actually this uh, might help you stay fit and do not take an extra kilos during the student's life during student's life my tip uh, number three uh, your pocket money uh, you can use uh, actually for cultural life and I mean not only in, make going out uh, every week uh, and drink uh, alcohol but also search an interesting events uh, in malls or in another city and uh, use your student status uh, and get a good uh, a reduction thus uh, will be more interesting in my opinion my tip number four uh, actually, even if the, in the university, if you don't like uh, to spend your pocket money or you don't have uh, a lot of pocket money, you can have an interesting activity. There are sport clubs, different sport clubs, uh, as I know, volleyball, football, something else. Um, we have a theater, English theater, uh, and uh, we have even a competition of char leaders uh, in spring. So it's up to you, you can uh, participate in any kind of activities. And the last one tip, uh, if uh, you still have your pocket money at the end of the year, I suggest you to invest it in, in the trip, in language trip. Actually, every department, um, each department, uh, sorry, uh, uh, the um, of our faculty organized uh, some linguistic uh, trips um, at the end of the year. And uh, you can actually do this because it's a great uh, opportunity to practice your language with native speakers uh, and uh, to see the world. Uh, that uh, the um, five tips on students' life uh, so far. Let's move on to the studying process. And my tip number one: uh, think about uh, your personal notes. Yeah, I know that uh, someone can say that it's a waste of time, but believe me, no. Uh, when you're making your own notes, uh, you memorize it better three times uh, if when you're only reading um, the text. Why? Because you're writing it uh, and you're memorizing, you're watching on it and you're memorizing, and also you're thinking about uh, it uh, um, in order to create a short text. Precis. Um, my tip number two, uh, don't waste your time, actually, uh, even if you didn't have a possibility to find an accommodation at Mons, uh, okay, you can still use your time 
uh, to for studying uh, and the transport. Uh, for example, uh, you can listen to your uh, audio materials, you can read uh, there, you can even finish your makeup if you didn't have uh, time uh, to accomplish it at home. My uh, tip number three, think about uh, your gadgets. I mean, it's really cool to have the last model of cell phone, but actually we are not allowed to use them uh, during the classes, even if you would like to see some of your files that you saved, upload uh, beforehand. So uh, I'm suggesting you to buy a tablet. Why? Because uh, it's light. Um, for your shoulders uh, you can uh, save there a lot of um, files they are always with you you can read it uh, even in the bus uh, even when it's dark <laughs> and um, tablets are allowed uh, during our classes my tip number four i think uh, my tip number four, and uh, maybe it's not really pleasant, but uh, start your day early. Even if you have classes uh, from uh, 10 a.m. Uh, or even uh, from midday, uh, come to the university early and study at the library. Why? Because, believe me, at the end of the day, after all your classes, you will be exhausted and thus you will not waste your time. My last suggestion to you is to prepare for your exams at the university. Why? Uh, because actually I can say that it's rather difficult to focus on your study at home when you're alone, where there are a lot of uh, uh, possibilities uh, to spend your time as an internet, uh, I don't know, or food, or uh, friends, or something else, uh, while at the university you have uh, quite a lot of crazy people <laughs> who are just uh, studying, 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 preparing, preparing, and preparing for the exams and uh, they might motivate you. So, now you know all my uh, uh, tips uh, mm, the, that I used uh, during uh, my student, my first year at the university. I hope uh, all, they all were useful for you, or at least some of them. Thank you for watching me and see you next time.